Hey YouTube, um, I haven't uploaded anything in a while, I'm so sorry. School and other stuff have been keeping me busy because I'm in my junior year and I'm just trying to get things sorted and it's not working out as planned and I, I get worried easily so it's not helping at all but um, it's, it's not as bad as I thought it would be so that's one good thing. So I was to Port I went to Portugal and people who have me on Facebook, um, I said I might buy some new models but I didn't really see any that I really wanted. Like in the past there were a few but I took a closer look at them and now I'm like ugh, why did I want them? Because I mean I have a lot of models now. I'd love to like give some away and like rebuy them because in the past I just bought them because I really wanted them and then I got into the whole idea of like keep getting the nicest ones. So my friend, uh, I gave her the Hanoverian Stallion with the rider, the little, you know the rider with the pink jacket, the blonde hair and the brown tack? I gave her that because we're best friends and whatnot and there's a whole story behind it. But anyways, um, this is one of the models she gave me. It's the Quarter Horse Mare from the year 2000. See? Whoop. Right, from the year 2000. She looks a hell of a lot like the Hanoverian Stallion. I do not know why, but <laughs> she's quite cute. If she wasn't a quarter horse and she wore some kind of sport horse, like an Irish sport horse, because my trainer in, in Portugal has an Irish sport horse called Sunset, I would definitely call it that. And I changed the face markings. Sloppy job there, but whatever. <laughs> and then she gave me this one, which is from... 1992. Right. Um, she's adorable. She's probably the only model I have seen with a swishy tail, except, well, I don't know, that grey and illusion stallion up there, swishy tail. That's like the, the, the smallest swishy tail I've seen in existence, but anyways. She's gorgeous. She's been scuffed up because, yeah, my friend got her when she was a child, so... But if you look, if you look up pictures on Google, like these legs, I don't know if they're meant to be this white, but on I've put on pictures I've seen, they look more black. But I guess I don't know. Maybe this one has been worked on or something. I have no idea. Anyway, it's pretty cool. And then I and I stocked up. Um, we went to Germany the week before, no, the weekend before, and I got some jump rings. No, not jump rings. Um, lobster clasp thingies. See right there. Okay, that's better. I need to keep things centered. Okay, silver. And then I got these bronzy gold ones. They look like white gold for some reason. I have no idea why. See? So yeah, they're, they're not the ones I really, really wanted, but I just got them anyways just in case I needed them. And then I got these ages ago. Whoa. This camera really washed that color. In real life, they look so much more vibrant. Anyways, they were really expensive because they weren't for like um, jewelry making. They were more like for uh, the little remote control cars and stuff. So, and then I got these back in Holland, which was like in the summer. God, summer seems so long ago. So they came like uh, yeah, no, these are meant to be separated. Oh no, they are separated. See, so I got these. But then also you got like these keychain type things that like some people YouTubers use because they can't find the others. So yeah, um, I guess that's basically it. I haven't worked on my stables at all. Well, I have. I had to fix them once because my little cat, Bella, uh, she kind of um, crashed into them or something like that. Oh yeah, by the way, if you're wondering what breed she is, she is a mix between a common European and a Siamese. And she has one hell of an attitude, which is cute. I love it. Um, oh, wait. Did she wake up? No, she didn't. And I guess that's it. Um, I haven't done anything. As you can see, oh my god, uh, I saw those. I saw one of that one of those gray cats in the background, but I didn't have my money on me, and I couldn't ask like my friend to buy it for me because she'd think I'm an absolute loon. But if I do go back, I'll go get it and I'll see if I can get some acrylics from my sister or something because she has art. So we'll see. Uh, there's not much. Um, by the way, for people who are asking. Uh, one of my very first videos, I said I'd make like a database and I'd share it with people. Uh, I never got around to doing it and I don't think I will because I'm too busy. Also, um, people are asking me if I sell my tack. Generally, no, because that means I'd have to be constantly spending money 
on ribbon and material. And this is just like the only material I have basically for a long time. So yeah, um, I'm probably going to still try and recreate my own little stables. Make my little wonderland or something. Um, what else? Uh, I went to Portugal, didn't buy anything. Whoops, I'm zooming in. Uh, horse riding is great. I'll link the videos to you guys if you guys are interested. Um, subscribe to that channel too. Uh, I don't post vi videos very regularly, but yeah, we'll see. And then, um, what else? Uh, the ride was really cool. Horse riding is going okay. I'm still looking for a lease horse, but... Uh, Every time I find a lease horse to try out, I, I only ride once a week, so I only go like on Saturdays. By that time, somebody's already trying it out and saying, oh, I'll, I want to keep this one on hold and then I have to wait, wait another week and then it's already taken. I'm like, well, that sucks because I'm looking for a horse. So I've, I've gone through a gazillion horses now. And quite frank, I'm getting kind of sick and tired. I just, I just, I, I'm still trying to persuade my parents to buy Pegasus because he's the, the best fit for me. Because here, you can say what you want. Horse riding, yes, it's universal, but then every country has a bit of its own tweak. So, like, here they only they tend to only ride on snaffles, which I find kind of weird. Not weird, but it's not what I'm used to. I'm, I'm you know, I'm used to using any range of bits. So, yeah. Um, I'll post a video at the end to show about this. Oh, my God, I forgot. This tack piece. I made it. Focus. Right. Uh, this tack piece, I made it. It still needs working. This needs to be replaced. Everything goes like that, like that, like that. And then... It's like that. Not that big of a deal, really. Um, I, I've, I've tried different threads, but I don't have much. And I don't want to spend my money if I do get to, like, lease or buy a horse. So, yeah. Um... Uh, if you guys have any questions, then PM me or comment me or post something on my general um, main page. If I don't get to you straight away, I'm so sorry. As you know now, I'm just a very busy student, so yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll hopefully post more often now. So yeah, bye!